In the last video about installing a new extruder, I promised to show how I adjusted the e-step values on my Sovol SV06 Plus 3D printer. E, of course, stands for the extruder stepper motor. The e-step value is the number of steps the newly installed stepper motor needs to take to extrude one millimeter of filament. It is important to get this right to avoid under or over extrusion. With the right hardware and software tools, however, it's pretty easy to measure and set the correct e-step value. It helps to use an e-step calculator. You can simply search for one on Google. In this video, I'll be using a simple calculator from Printer Mod. We just need to enter two numbers, the current e-step value and the actual length that is extruded. So we need to check the current value under the steps section in advanced settings on the printer. I took note of the current value, which I originally obtained for my other extruder. And also entered this value into the online e-step calculator. For the next step, I actually designed and printed my own extrusion ruler. By the generally recommended procedure, we need to extrude 100 millimeters of filament and measure how much was actually extruded. This extrusion ruler is specifically designed to fit on the top of the extruder of the Sovol SV06 and SV06 Plus and even the SV07 if we remove the extruder cover. I even added a little indentation on the bottom to encounter for the 1.8 mm of protrusion around the feeding hole on these extruders. The ruler needs only 10 grams of filament and I was able to print it in 15 minutes using the upgraded 0.6 mm nozzle on my printer. Included with the STL file for the ruler, you will find a PDF file as well with the scale, which can be printed on a regular or sticker paper and stick it so the zero point is aligned with the mark on the ruler. If you don't have paper printer, you can use a regular ruler to copy the millimeter marks on a sticker paper. Look in the description of this video for the link to the STL model of my extrusion ruler and the PDF scale. And while you're there, please remember to like this video and subscribe for more content like this in the future. The ruler makes things very easy. We need a light color filament, ideally white and simply feed it through the extrusion ruler. There is a small hole at the top that fits the tip of a Sharpie pen, so we can draw a mark on the filament. In the refuel section on the printer, we enter the desired extrusion length, 100 millimeters. The nozzle will heat up to 200 degrees before we can press the feed button. We can see how the little dot moves down on the extrusion ruler and we can simply read where it stops. In my case, you can see the middle of the dot stopped at the 106 millimeter mark on the scale. This would cause a slight over extrusion if not corrected. Entering 106 in the calculator gives us the new e-step value, which I can easily punch into the printer's advanced settings and I didn't even forget to also press store. And that's actually it. One more important thing, if you want to test if the new value is okay, make sure to power cycle the printer. This time the extrusion amount was spot on for me. The new extruder is now perfectly tuned for our next adventures with the Sovol SV06+. What these are going to be, don't forget to subscribe to find out.